Seemingly never-ending violence has local moms calling for change. Volunteers with a grassroots safety movement, Moms Demand Action, pleading for Congress to do something about gun control. Activists gathering in New Jersey to rally for change and call on lawmakers to stop the bloodshed. Our Ellen Kaloje with more. On this Mother's Day weekend, some women with a group called Moms Demand Action say they don't want gifts or breakfast in bed. They want people to demand action from Washington when it comes to guns. It's hard to go on living without my son. 11 years ago, Elizabeth Echeverria's son, Nicholas, was shot and killed on the streets of Camden. And not a day goes by that she doesn't think of the 19-year-old college student and how his life might have turned out. He didn't get to meet a girl, have a wife get married, you know, the big mother-son dance at the wedding, no children, nothing. That's why Elizabeth and dozens of others joined Moms Demand Action to call on Congress to ban assault weapons. I thought it was important to um, support local organizations, even though I'm not in the area, it affects us all. Kevlin Tigett brought her grandsons from Vineland, New Jersey on this Mother's Day weekend because she says gun violence is something they are all too familiar with every day in our society. It's showing them that getting involved, no matter how small, no matter how big, it makes a difference. You, their friends will see them getting involved and they might want to get involved, so it's a step. Guns are not the answer and never will be. Thank you. And it's not just adults who had a message for lawmakers. Ten-year-old Emily Gray wanted to make sure her voice was heard too. It kind of helps to just be able to express your feelings and speak for what you think's right. And as the demonstrators made their way across the Ben Franklin Bridge, they hope everyone sees their message, hears their concerns, and takes action. The gun violence is crazy now. It's just too much. It's time for people to put down these guns. So this day of action wasn't just a local thing. It happened all over the country. And now the organizers hope people will contact their lawmakers to let them know exactly how they feel about gun control. Ellen Kaloje, Fox 29 News.